Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel CBSE Courses with Riti. So today we are going to start with real numbers. As you know, we have already completed the introduction of real numbers and now we have to start with exercise 1.2. So let's do first question number one. Question number one says, it's a proving question, proving irrationality. So we have to prove root 5 is irrational. Right? How will you do that? Any guesses? So firstly, line which I said ki yaad kar lene ko. Let's take root 5 as rational number. Okay? You will consider it a rational number. Therefore, root 5 is equals to A upon B where A and B are co-prime numbers. Now what is a co-prime number? So co-prime number is ki ye dono ka koi, ye dono ka aur koi factor common nahi hai. Okay? So what we'll do is we'll do contradiction method. We'll contradict ki ye root 5 jo hone rational baan hai, ye jhoot hai and then we'll say that now agar ye jhoot hai ki ye rational number nahi hai, then obviously it's a irrational number. We'll do so you will get to understand. Now square on both sides. This step is to square on both sides. So root 5 ka square is equals to a square by b square and root 5 ka square kya ban jayega? 5. Right? It will be 5. How? So root 5 into root 5 is equals to 5 only. Simple, right? Now what we'll do next? We will now put this b square this side. हमें सिर्फ एक यहाँ a स्क्वायर चाहिए तो इस b स्क्वायर को यहाँ से यहाँ ले आएंगे तो क्या हो जाएगा ये ऐसे में करते रुको एक मिनट दिस विल बी कंफ्यूजन ये तो फर्स्ट स्टेप था नाउ सेकंड स्टेप क्या है दिस फाइव इक्वल्स तू a स्क्वायर बाय b स्क्वायर आई पुट दिस b स्क्वायर दिस साइड यहाँ डिवाइडेड तो यहाँ क्या राइट right? मैं इसको ऐसे भी तो लिख सकती हूँ b square is equals to a square by five I can write it down like this also so what does this mean this means that a square is divisible by five so now you will write down this line therefore a square is divisible by five now the thing is I told you a theorem in the introduction video कि अगर a square divisible है five से तो a भी divisible five से होगा like I said कि अगर four square is divisible by two then 4 is also divisible by 2 and the video is checking also you can check out the video it's available on my channel if you are having any confusion so a square is divisible by 5 so according to a theorem a is also you can just write it here hence a is also divisible by 5 it's not a sum of yoga now I'm going to continue the sum here because here we are out of space Okay, let me just do it. Now, we'll start our equation from here. Now, what we'll do is, we'll consider 5a as. So, now, ye to aapko samaj aagaya, a square is equal to 5b square. So, now what we'll do is, we'll consider a square is equal to 5c whole square. Kya samaj aaya? Dekho. मैंने क्या कहा कि 5b स्क्वायर जो है वो a स्क्वायर से डिविजिबल है मतलब a स्क्वायर से 5 डिविजिबल है और a से भी डिविजिबल है 5 अब मैं क्या कर रही हूं 5 को मैंने यहां रखा सेम आई नो दैट a इज डिविजिबल बाय 5 बट यहां मैंने एक c वेरिएबल यूज किया सेइंग दैट c इज अ नेचुरल नंबर और मेरा a स्क्वायर जो है वो 5c स्क्वायर के इक्वल है तो इसका क्या मतलब हो गया a स्क्वायर अब इसके इक्वल था लेकिन a स्क्वायर तो 5b स्क्वायर के भी इक्वल था राइट right? ये वाला अगर आप चेक करो तो a स्क्वायर तो 5b स्क्वायर के भी इक्वल है तो अब क्या करेंगे सो द इक्वेशन इज नाउ लाइक a स्क्वायर तो मैं रिप्लेस करूंगी 5b स्क्वायर से ये 5c स्क्वायर मैंने इसलिए लिया क्योंकि आई कैन राइट इट लाइक दिस इस तरह से मैं लिख सकती हूं सो so, बात वही आई एम जस्ट एडिंग अ इंटीजर c ठीक है सो नाउ a स्क्वायर को हम 5b स्क्वायर लेते हैं सो so, 5b स्क्वायर इक्वल टू c square now if you'll check so 5 yaha pe cut jayega 5 5 ja 5 so 5 5 ja 5 1 ja therefore 
b square is equal to 5c square. ठीक है? ये बात समझ आ गई? Now if you check it, तो जो सिनारियो यहाँ था, same सिनारियो अब यहाँ आ गया है. ठीक है? जो सिनारियो यहाँ था, same सिनारियो we are getting up here as well. So now what you'll do? What we'll do is we will write the same line as it is here as well. Let me write it for you. So as you can see, मैंने यहाँ पे एक line line add किया है that hence b square is divisible by five. Also b is divisible by five. ऐसा क्यों लिखा मैंने? Because I can write it down like b square by five. ये b like five. तो इसी line इसी formula को I have written in my words, not by formula but by words. फिर तो समझ आ गया? Now what you got is here you you got that a square is divisible by five and a is also divisible by five. Same you get here कि b square is also divisible by five, b is divisible by five. तो क्या हुआ हमें a square, b square, a और b ये सब है five से divisible. But this is a contradiction because मैंने यहाँ a and b were my co prime numbers. मेरे a and b were our co prime numbers. तो ये ही होना चाहिए था. This is a wrong thing. अगर ऐसा हो गया, then तो मेरी पूरी assumption पे मैंने लिखा था let's say इसको actually आप पता क्या करो? Let's assume कर लो. So it will be more easy to write down. Let's assume root five as rational number. और ये पूरा solution. First we'll just do that. Okay? Take a screenshot. मैं यहाँ rub कर रही हूँ क्योंकि मुझे इसके आगे के equation को लिखना है. Okay? Hmm yeah. Okay. So उसके आगे यहाँ जो आपने लाइन लिखी थी उसके आगे यू विल राइट लेट मी प्लीज ड्रॉ लाइन हाँ दिस नहीं पहले आप लिखो बोथ ए एंड बी आर डिविजिबल बाय फाइव अब ये मैंने क्या किया हमने प्रूफ किया डेट ए जो है पहले हमने प्रूफ किया कि ए फाइव से डिविजिबल है फिर मैंने एक और प्रूफ किया कि बी बी फाइव से but this comes a very important line. But this contradicts our assumption. A consi assumption ko contradict kar Just tell me. Many silly rubbing here. Just tell me consi contradiction ko hum. Yaha pe contradict consi assumption ko kar So that A and B are co prime. So, our assumption was that root 5 is a rational number and A and B are co prime. But here, as both A and B are divisible by 5, this contradicts our assumption that A and B are co prime numbers. Okay? This contradicts our assumption. Hence, root 5 is irrational. Simple and crystal clear. Here, I have told slowly, slowly. But this is a work of just three to four minutes. You can easily do it. First time, याद कर लो, जो भी आपने यहाँ नंबर दिया, उसको इससे replace करना है. Second, last में conclusion, you will get this only. Now one, we'll do question number two. That is a bit different, but not very much. So I hope you like my video. If you like my video, so do like, subscribe, and share my channel. Also, don't forget to ring the bell hang button so you will get all the notifications of my channel.